All right, ladies and gentlemen, now we are going into the creamery. So what's this? This is our milk house. So we have our milking barn. And what happens in our milking barn, once we milk the cows, the milk comes into this big glass jar, piped in through stainless steel pipes into the big glass jar. And it comes up the pipes. And we usually fix another pipe. We switch pipes over. And the milk goes into this tank. This is called a bulk tank. And in it is some, um, oh, well, right now it's empty because we milked this morning and Aww. cleaned out the tank. This is our first little milking. We cleaned out the tank to um, bottle some milk this morning, but it's a refrigerated tank that holds the milk at a certain temperature, below 40 degrees, 40, 45, below. That's very important. Milk is the most regulated food in the USA, and temperature control is absolutely important. The milk in this tank is tested every two weeks for... Um, the health of the cow, somatic cell count, standard plate, the temperature at which, which it is held. And we also test general cleanliness, coliform, as well as the quality of the water, because all of this equipment is washed with water. And so that's important for us, that there's no E. coli or any other um, uh, pathogens in the water. This is our little system. We have, we milk 28 cows, and we'd love to hand milk, but there are only two of us. And so as a result, we use some gentle suction vacuum pumps. And um, this evening, when you come out to the milking barn for the evening milking, we'll show you how that works. All right. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. This is Akaini reporting to you from Gitanagari Farm inside the creamery.